The OSBI now says the search for a four-year-old Athena Brownfield is officially a recovery effort. Investigators do not believe the little girl is alive. We know both her caretakers are behind bars and one is facing murder complaints and waiting to be extradited from Arizona back to Oklahoma. News on 6's Haley Weger joins us live in Caddo County with more. Haley. That's right, guys. This really isn't the update anybody was hoping for today, but the OSBI does tell us they're treating the search for missing Athena as a recovery operation at this point. They're still searching here in Caddo County, along with Oklahoma Highway Patrol, for the missing toddler's remains. Now they are also we're also waiting here at Caddo County Detention Center for Ivan Adams to be extradited in Phoenix. He's facing one count of first degree murder and one count of child neglect. Alicia Adams is also being held in Caddo County on two counts of child neglect as well. We're told Athena and her five year old sister were in Av Ivan and Alicia's care for at least a year. The OSBI and other local and statewide law enforcement have been searching for Athena since last Tuesday. They tell us that Athena's five-year-old sister was found outside their Cyril home on January 10th with no adult supervision at that home. Hundreds of people have joined in the search to find Athena, but today the OSBI is telling us that they're asking the public not to self-deploy to search for Athena. They say individuals who search for Athena on their own could be trespassing or worse, interfering with the investigation by contaminating potential evidence. Now, Ivan Adams is still being held in Phoenix at this point and will be extradited back to Oklahoma within the next 30 days. Live in Caddo County, Haley Wager, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.